Oh, damn, YouTube got filters now? Oh, damn, it looks so damn realistic. How the? F now, I know what you guys are thinking. Joy, what the right, Let's start from the very beginning. So, I bought tickets for Miami. So, I saw the concert in Miami. Super dope. Brought Campbell with me. It was so fun. We got good seats. I got bronze VIP. I got to see the sound check. Got some Peace Minus One merch that comes with the VIP stuff. Wait, where is it? You know, I had to cop the hat. I had to cop the G-Dragon Multi 3 hat. And it comes with the Peace Minus One clips that it comes with. It's definitely one of my favorite concerts because, first of all, I love G-Dragon. I love Big Bang. So finally seeing G-Dragon in concert was definitely a check off my bucket list and I got to meet some of y'all I got to hang out with friends too, so it was definitely a great night Mm, Mark I hooked it up with some sweet tickets meaning like sweet like box office sweet tickets in Brooklyn So I just flew my ass there. I always keep my tickets for memory sake. See sweet level It was pretty dope. That was my first time being in the Barclay Center venue, and then I really like it It's such a unique design the inside is really dope and of course we're there for G drag So shout out to Mark of the Adam M and shout out to the vice president of General Monster for hooking it up as well Speaking of Gentle Monster hold up I'm gonna rock the gentle monsters just for y'all because these are hot. These are fire. I had these for a good uh, since uh, last Christmas. Definitely want to get another pair. So yeah. <laughs> so shout out to them because they gave me the tickets and I was in their suite. I always think G Dragon is gonna do some crazy ish. Like you know, bring out uh, like uh, I think last time he brought like a, a clear Lamborghini or some kind of Lamborghini. Like a more of a personal uh, concert. Like the concept is like you know. Accept him as Kwon Ji Young. Anyways, so I had a few friends in other suites over there. They told me to come through just to say hi. Before that, I was introduced to uh, Ruda. Shout out to Ruda. From what I've been told, he's in the marketing advertising or the energy marketing of Nike. Nice having a little conversation with you. I think that was pretty dope. You were really chill. Friends of mine, uh, Chi and Peter, and I came through just to say hello. And I, you know, I chopped it up with some people. I drank a little bit, you know, had a good time. It's a G-Dragon concert. We're enjoying the music. We're enjoying the festivities. Then I went back to my original suite and watched the whole concert from there, enjoying it with Mark from the Adam M and the VP of Gentle Monster. Watching a G-Dragon concert is just like a blessing, I feel like. So after the concert, we said our goodbyes. I went to go to the other suite to say goodbye to my friends over there. And then out of nowhere, the opportunity arises of going backstage. Who the F knew that shit was gonna happen? So, see the thing is that when an opportunity just comes out of nowhere, sometimes you just gotta take it. You could say it's luck. You could say it's timing. I think it's a little bit of both. And uh, thank you. Went backstage and uh, yeah. There for about like a good 45 minutes. Just, you know, chilling. I talked to some people. 
you know, because people were just there, you know, eating, drinking, just hanging around. I said, hi, my name is Dre. It's nice to meet you. He's holding flowers in the picture. And, uh, yeah, I just said that it was a good show. I was in Miami, so-and-so. That's about it. Just a little conversation. And then we took a picture. That's basically about it. Went so quick and, you know, I'm just thankful for the opportunity, to be honest. Like, just to be able to be in his presence, to be able to see uh, Kwon Ji Young. And, um, yeah. <laughs> I'm thankful to be in that situation. I don't know how I get in these situations. Like I said, these things are not planned. They're just, it just happens. You know? So I'm just thankful to be in that situation and yeah. And to be honest, I didn't want to vlog. I felt weird if I did vlog or videoed stuff, situations like backstage. Because sometimes you have to separate the fan, the YouTuber, and just act like a normal human being in a normal situation. <laughs> Which is, I say it's a normal situation and you're like, what? To be honest, I was fanboying inside, to be honest. That's what I just gotta say. <laughs> Here's the video with my friend Chi with G-Dragon. Also, Christina, uh, the famous photographer, was there. The concert lived up to my expectations from the very beginning uh, when Heartbreaker just broke out to the monologues, to just like the videos, the intermissions. Just like the whole vibe of the concert was lit. Did not expect to be meeting G-Dragon. Even though people was like, oh, you're gonna meet G-Dragon. People think I, I'm gonna meet someone, but I don't think that way. I don't wanna think like, oh, I gotta meet this person. No, if the opportunity arises, I just take it. I just went with the flow, and I, like I said, I'm thankful. G-Dragon, thank you for the greatest experience. Just wanna say thank you to everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for subscribing. We're almost at a million subscribers, which is crazy to me. People get my reminder like, yo, you're almost at a mil. I'm like, it's pretty crazy. <laughs> I would never think that I would get to a million subscribers. Keep on dreaming, dreamers. Dream, believe, do, repeat. Dreamer hats are on sale right now. Um, link in the description and uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm just thankful for everything. Like every night. And I'm gonna get personal here. Like every night. I do pray, and I always thank, say thank you for everything. Like every night, ever since I was a kid. This was a good trip. All right, All right before this gets any too personal, I'm gonna end it here. Uh, thank you guys, like, share, and subscribe, and um, yeah, bye for now. Till next time. <laughs> hey. You better subscribe. Welcome back to that same old place that you laughed about.